Hey guys, welcome back, I'm Jay. In this episode, we're gonna look at AWS Private Link. AWS Private Link enables you to access services on AWS securely, by keeping your traffic within the AWS network. These services include supported AWS services, endpoint services hosted by other AWS accounts, and supported partner services in AWS Marketplace. With Private Link, your applications can access supported services, using interface VPC endpoints inside a VPC. Communications between your applications inside the VPC and other services travel over Private Link. You can share your services with other AWS accounts or resources and other VPCs over Private Link. You can create your own AWS Private Link powered service, referred to as an endpoint service, and enable other AWS customers to access your service. On-premises applications can connect to AWS service endpoints in the VPC, over Direct Connect or VPN. Service endpoints will direct the traffic to AWS services over Private Link, while keeping the network traffic within the AWS network. Private Link is integrated with AWS Marketplace. As an AWS Marketplace seller, you can provide customers access to your service through a VPC endpoint across the AWS network using Private Link. Here's how resources in your VPC access AWS services without using Private Link. You need to deploy your application in a public VPC and subnet. From the public VPC, your application can access AWS services via Internet Gateway. Traffic between your application and AWS services need to traverse over the Internet. Your VPC and subnet are open to the public, which increases the potential risks of DDoS attacks or data leak. Some regulations restrict certain types of data from flowing to the public network. To keep traffic within the AWS network, you can deploy your application in a private VPC and subnet, and connect to AWS services using interface VPC endpoints powered by Private Link. An interface endpoint is an elastic network interface or ENI, with a private IP address from the IP range of your subnet, that serves as an entry point, for traffic destined to a supported service. Private Link restricts all traffic between your VPC and services within the AWS network. You can connect your VPCs to AWS services in a secure and scalable manner with Private Link. Private Link traffic doesn't traverse the internet, reducing the exposure to internet threat, such as brute force and DDoS attacks. You can secure traffic using private IP connectivity and security groups, so that your services function as hosted directly on your private network. Private Link significantly simplifies your internal network. You can connect services across different accounts and VPCs within your organization, with no need for complex firewall rules and routing policies. You don't need to maintain an internet gateway or a VPC peering connection. Private Link helps easily migrate on-premises resources to AWS Cloud. On-premises applications can connect to service endpoints over Direct Connect or VPN. Service endpoints direct traffic to AWS services over Private Link, while keeping the network traffic within the AWS network. Private Link enables SaaS providers to offer services that look and feel like they are hosted directly on a private network. Private Link helps protect personally identifiable information or PII by keeping the traffic of sensitive data private. PII traffic doesn't traverse the internet, reducing the risk of data being compromised. Private Link helps meet compliance requirements such as HIPAA and PCI DSS. You can use Private Link with endpoint services, supported services in AWS Marketplace, and AWS services that are integrated with Private Link. The endpoint service is also called Private Link Powered Service. Endpoint services are services hosted by other AWS accounts. You can create your own application in your VPC and configure it as an endpoint service. Other AWS principals can create a connection from their VPC to your application, using an interface VPC endpoint. When you sell your service in AWS Marketplace, you can also offer customers to access your service using an interface VPC endpoint over Private Link. These services include API Gateway, Auto Scaling, CloudWatch, Amazon EMR, AWS Glue, Amazon Kinesis, SageMaker, Amazon RDS, AWS KMS, Amazon SQS and more. VPC Peering Connection is a networking connection between two VPCs, which enables you to route traffic between them privately. Instances in either VPC can communicate with each other, as if they are within the same network. VPC Peering is suited when you want to create a small cross-VPC network. However, if you want to provide your hosted services to many other VPCs or AWS accounts, 
VPC peering is not a scalable approach. As you need to set up peering connections with all VPCs across all AWS accounts, where consumers' applications are located. Because VPC peering connection is a two-way connection. It increases the network complexity when you want to restrict access on one side of peered VPCs. You can create your own application in your VPC, and make it a private link-powered service or endpoint service. Other AWS principals can create a connection from their VPC to your endpoint service, using an interface VPC endpoint. This is a more scalable way to provide private access to many other VPCs or AWS accounts, especially if you are a SaaS provider. To provide the VPC endpoint service, you need a network load balancer in front of your applications running on EC2 in the endpoint service VPC, and create a VPC endpoint service configuration, and specify the network load balancer. The service consumers with required permissions can create an interface endpoint in the customer's VPC, and connect the endpoint service. After the connection is activated, resources in consumers' VPC can access the endpoint service via interface endpoint over private link. In this episode, we've learned AWS Private Link. Private Link enables you to access services on AWS securely, by keeping your traffic within the AWS network. These services include supported AWS services, endpoint services hosted by other AWS accounts, and supported partner services in AWS Marketplace. Private Link significantly simplifies your internal network. You can connect services across different accounts and VPCs within your organization, with no need for complex firewall rules and routing policies. You don't need to maintain an internet gateway or a VPC peering connection. Okay, that's all for AWS Private Link. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode. Hope you've enjoyed watching this episode. If you liked the video, please help us and hit the like button. If you want to watch more tutorials, please subscribe to the Cloudemy TV channel. Make sure to turn on the notification and stay tuned. At Cloudemy, we're passionate about cloud and AI technology. Please share your feedback and thoughts in the comments below. Feel free to let us know what topics you'd like to watch. Happy watching and happy learning.